of that, let's yawn. You don't have an item. What are you thinking? You fool. You fool, you fool. Okay, quick stomping tantrum. Uh-oh. Sweet. How many how much stuff do I have? Oh, we're good. Okay. Passimian, Venomoth, Fungus, Grafai I saw something else. Could have sworn I saw something else in here. Also, he jumped out at the last ball. Or the last rock. I hate when they fucking do this shit, man. Like, you're sleeping. Stay asleep. There you go. Also, how come Venomoth is here, but not Venomoth? Acrobatics. It's not a better water move, but I'll take it. Actually, I'll just get rid of Dive right now. <laughs> Alright, well, Passimian, the teamwork Pokemon. The boss chooses 10 members of the group to go out hunting. The hunting party will evenly split the food they find with the rest of the group. Very nice, very nice. But I want Venomoth now. And since Venomoth is a poison type, it cannot accidentally poison itself. Alright, now we stomping tantrum. Ooh. Yo, I hope they make... I hope they make plushies for Claude Sire. This thing is literally plushy material, and it looks amazing. Sweet. Pokeball time. You're almost in the red. You're fast asleep. Couldn't imagine you leaving the ball. There we go. Orthworm wants to learn takedown. No thanks. <laughs> but Venomoth, the poison moth Pokemon, when it attacks, it flaps its large wings violently to scatter poisonous powder all around. Like I said, dude, might as well try to complete the decks while we're, or as much of the decks as we can, I should say. Because who knows when I'm going to have this chance again. Don't have Fungus. Let's do what we can to get Fungus. Pokeball, catch Pokeball. And then Grafai Eye was in the trees, so we need to make sure we. I think we're supposed to ram the tree or something. You're just a Fungus. What are you doing? And I hope we can, like, I don't know if we have to wait until post-game to, uh, to catch the Paradox Pokemon. But I, if we can catch him early, I would love to do that. Because I heard, uh, I heard that you have to do it post-game, but, like, there's so many dope... Pokemon in the uh Impidimp Impidimp are here What the hell I don't know how to feel about these Pokemon being 
around the same level as me slash higher. Please, why? This is the worst outcome. Is that a fungus? Yeah, it is. If you hurt yourself, or if you accidentally kill it... Oh my god. Holy moly. Alright, well let's throw an Ultra Ball. I think Impotent makes six. For Pokemon we can catch in this area alone. Because we have the pig. We have both... The both, uh, forms. Or both genders. The Willy Pokemon. They live in groups, pestering and playing pranks on each other to polish their troublemaking skills. Oh, that is so sweet. But now look what you did. Now I gotta heal. Okay. See, look. I'm pretty sure... What is that? Oh, it's the pig. I'm pretty sure we're supposed to... Oh. <gasps> no! That's not the one I wanted! No, it's not the one I wanted. I wanted the Grafai Eye over there. Alright, let's poison jab. I know this is high risk for the poison. Fuck. Uh, at the same time, I knew that was coming, though. But I need to hurry with Pinaco, dude. This thing probably has explosion. And I am wasting too much time with it. And we're leveling up, so... The Bagworm. It spits out a fluid that uses the glue tree bark to its body. The fluid hardens when it touches the air. Oh. Seeing Pinaco again reminds me of my Pokemon Gold playthrough when we had Matsu. Hi, buddy. You little monkey boy. Girl. Monkey gal. I'm gonna click poison jab. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god, look at it sleeping, dude. Motherfucker had humongous eyeballs. And just... Oh. Wait. I'm pretty sure we have Dunsparce, right? Pretty certain we have a Dunsparce. Grafai Eye, the toxic monkey. Each Grafai Eye paints its own individual pattern, and it will paint that same pattern over and over again throughout its life. Wow. Ripped. Uh, heal up. Oh, we might have healing items. Yo, is that Komala? Is Komala back? <laughs> Dude. Oh yeah, Comatose. I forgot about its ability. Wait, what? Did you just use that? Oh, you motherfucker. Hey, what are you doing? Yeah. I texted you guys. How's it going? Oh my god, look at the 
Dude, I know. Kalmala's finally back in the game. Holy shit. Maybe they shouldn't come back in. He just annihilated your ash cheeks. Oh, look at the, the inventory art. That's so cool. Yeah, dude, oh, just, this is the thing with the hammer. I'm just out on the grind. Hell yeah. Yeah, what are you guys up to? I just got back from shopping. Nice. Got all my stuff to come on out Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah. I got reservations for my When? Tomorrow night at 7.45. Cool. I did hear that you have training from the ultimate team. Yeah, there's some chance that I'll have to uh, stay later because I guess there's a truck coming to unload. Because it was supposed to come today, but it broke down. So then they're like, yeah. It's not coming today, it's not coming tomorrow morning, it's coming tomorrow afternoon. So, I mean... It's pure overtime, still, but like... I told him, I can't stay later than five. Five? God damn, that Dude, I'm gonna punch this stupid fat fucking koala in the face. Is it a wild boy? Yeah. If this goddamn fucking koala does not stay in this Pokeball, we're gonna have fucking issues. Yeah. I need to get intimidated, you fucking Hell yeah. bitch. Will do. The drowsing Pokemon. A potent anesthetic can be made by diluting Komala's drool. This anesthetic was used for surgeries in the past. I mean, we're... What? Hi. Do we have Mimikyu? I don't remember. Do we have Mimikyu? We do have Mimikyu. Alright, fuck off. Oh. No. I'm sorry. No, don't do this to me. Oh, shit. No. I'm sorry. Please. Can we run now? We broke your thing? There you go. What happens if we run? Oh. It's... Nothing happens. Its ability just... Becomes undone. Huh. Full restore. S uh, there's Squo... There's Greedent. And there's Morgrim. Where are you running, you fat bitch? I know we don't have this thing. Oh my god, you ate that up. Damn, boy, he thick. Alright, let's see. Plus, this is giving us XP. It's completing the decks. It's giving us XP. So we have to keep, like, worrying about being underleveled. Okay. Well, that's not... That wasn't really, like, part of the deal. You're supposed to, like, stay in the ball. Come on, Creedon. You're the rodent of a game. Do not do this. Do not do this because I'm pretty sure I have, like, two or three more Pokemon to catch you. So help me God. You're a piece of shit. Dude. 
I'm gonna send out the worm. This thing is still... I don't understand. Do. Just stay in the ball. Just stay in it. Just stay in the ball. This episode's gonna be called Why Are Pokemon So Hard to Catch? Sir Hell, you're fucking you're fucking you're joking me. You're fucking joking me. This is a this is a fucking joke. This is a fucking joke. Alright. Okay. I have an idea. It's sleeping. We're using Super Fang. I'm actually gonna do it again. I'm gonna click Super Fang again and see what happens. I know it wakes up this turn. So it has Rest, Spit Up, Swallow, Keck, and it has Body Slam. Dude. Just stay, just stay in the ball. One. I have never seen a rodent Pokemon so hard to catch. It pisses me off more because this one is my favorite rodent of the game of Pokemon. And it has to be such a fucking pain in the ass. Like, dude. This Pokemon makes this Pokemon makes off with heaps of fallen berries by wrapping them in its tail, which roughly which is roughly twice the length of its body. Yeah, fuck you. Okay, well. Thank God we got revives and such. Wait, so it'll automatically make me use my healing items, but it doesn't use those? That's weird. You don't have any healing items handy. I have... Huh? I have an energy powder. I have four energy roots. But... I can't... It doesn't classify them as... Quick heat. I don't know. I guess it's just like potion, super potion, hyper potion. Hey. <laughs> Alright, let's poison jab. No, I didn't... I don't know. I thought I wouldn't kill. Uh, awkward. Are there more Morgrim? Are there more Morgrims lurking around? Who's in the water? I'm just saying we're 19 minutes into this episode. We're 19 minutes into the episode. And... Pokemon are being difficult. Honestly, I don't even remember how to get out of here. I'm pretty sure it was back that way I came, but... Oh. I'm trying to look for... Oh, it's a Fomantis. What the... Hi. Hi there. I mean, you didn't 
didn't have to, like, use that move. Alright. So I'm pretty sure, like, an hour ago as we're streaming, and two episodes ago as we recorded, I'm pretty sure we had 74... Oh, you motherfucker. I'm pretty sure we had 74 Pokeballs. And now we're down to 19. Where did I go wrong? I just want to get... All the Pokemons. I want to get all the Pokemons. But no. No, everything has to be a hassle. The Sickle Grass Pokemon. Many trainers give their Fomantis their own flower pots so they can sunbathe in peace and quiet. Oh, that's cute. Alright. Uh, don't... Besides Morgrem, I don't think there's anything else here. We already caught the Koala. We already caught Kamala's. There's so many trainers here too, dude. There's trainers here that I don't want to fight. I'm certain there's Pokemon here we haven't caught yet. What? What the hell is this? What? Where are we at? Ah, oh, it's you, Kamara. Oh, are we at the other one? I've been accepting the Operation Starfall. What's your end game, bro? I need answers, that's all. How do I resolve this situation with Team Star and what's causing its members odd behavior? Odd behavior? Team Star is the subject of more than a few nasty rumors swirling around the academy. Some say their bullying was caused a warring number of students to drop out of school. Others say they're holed up in their bases, plotting to cause trouble for the academy. But these are rumors. The matter that um, the matter I am directly confronting is with something else. I'm talking about Team Star's persistent truancy. They've all been skipping class. Five of them in particular, the so-called bosses of Team Star. And it seems the team's ranks and file have recently started stirring up mischief as well. That's why I took it upon myself to issue a direct order to Team Star. I inform them that they, sh that should they refuse, I would have no choice but to expel all students affiliated with their team. But I'm afraid there's been no response, and the deadline I set for them to make their choice between dissolution and expulsion is new is is nay nigh nigh upon us. I kind of more. Oh, can you hear me? Another time. Be careful. Was there someone with you? Just me. Just me, boss. Well. Be warned that Team Star will have its guard up. They won't go down as easily. I'll be in touch. Oh. Uh. I think I'll bring... I think I'll bring Tinka, Tinka Tuff with us. We got the ground typing. Actually, fuck it. Let's put Tinka Tuff in the front. Who cares? I have a lot of XP candies, too, that I'm not using. But should I use them? Probably not. Oh. Do me a favor and go home already, will ya? No. I want to see the boss of the Navi Squad. Like I said, kid, the boss told me not to let any outsiders pass in gates. I don't care. I'm not leaving till you let me talk to Don Atticus. You little doofus. Go say hello. <laughs> hello, huh? Oh great, here comes another rando to ruin my day. Hold on, Mr. Grunt. 
I think this girl might be Chimera. The one who took it. Prepare to be raided. <laughs> Get up. I knew it. Oh boy, this ain't good. Leave her to me, Mr. Grunt. I'll buy some time. What? Who is this? Who is this brat? When the crisis calls, one has no choice but to rally to those dear to him, no matter the cost. I'm gonna fucking destroy you. This little shit stain? Who is light years away from me? Golpin. Alright. Well, we only have Brutal Swing. Oh no, that's not good. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Jesus. I didn't even check the Golden's level. I'm 30. Can we not do this? I don't want to be here for fucking ever. Oh my god. And I hear a fucking gimme ghoul somewhere again. Okay. Tinka Tink or Tinka Tough, I think we've had a I think you've had enough. Mainly because this is boring. And now we can just end it right here with Flamethrower. <laughs> God damn it, dude. Hyper Voice. What's higher in their offensive stats? Brutal. Yeah, another Pokemon? You ugly. Why you got speed beat? Oh my god. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Big, but I'm no warrior. No shit, you're a rat. Get away from me. I'm sorry I failed you, Don Atticus. Are you alright? Got worried that maybe something bad happened to you over here. No fair, you had backup this whole time. Right, I'm not a member of Team Star, but Don Atticus is my compadre. I have to see him no matter what. Mira, I'd like to ask this boy some questions. You go ahead and get started on the base. Mind if I borrow you for a chat, my, uh, my man? Don't worry, I won't bite. Yikes, that is not something you should say ever to a child. <laughs> nice work dealing with the guard. Within the base lies Team Star's poison crew, the Navy Squad. Their boss, Atticus, designs the outfits for the team. So since it's beyond us to protect how you respond, just take out as many of his mons as he can. Well, okay, where's Gimme Ghoul? You shitter! I saw you. Give me your fucking coins. Wait, hold on. I'm putting Claude Sire, Tinkatuff, Tinkatuff's taking a seat on the bench. For now. I also need a heal. Some kid. Blah 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 blah, we already know this. 
so does that get harder? The whole defeating their Pokemon thing? Also, are my Pokemon still weak? No. Grimer, Crocolar, or Saviper. Come on. There you go. Go get him, Tinky. Go get him. Where did Tinky? Oh, there you go. Hey, everyone! Everyone's still looking pretty healthy too, so that's something. Oh. these things are always super easy to beat. I feel like they should get harder. She's way above our level. We gotta get the boss. Oh god. Here's the big boss. Whoa. Attic is Atticus a gal? Or is, he a, or is he a dude? Pray forgiven my sudden entry, oh lord. Tis I, Atticus. You're that scoundrel Chimera, I take it? You have some nerve bearing your fangs to Team Star. Come on then, villainous wrench. A plunge into a grim poison shall be your well-deserved fate. On guard! Jesus. <laughs> Maybe I should get more in character when I'm trying to do these voices, dude. Hey. Uh, yo, Atticus got moves, though. Oh. A scum tank. Not, but punishment awaits the wretch. A plague on your house. 32. That's not bad. Ooh, you know, hold on, I just thought of something. Eh, I guess we could just take out Skuntank. Do the bosses only have two Pokemon each? They have like an actual Pokemon and then the car. Oh, wait. What the fuck? Hold on, let me click Amnesia. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm gonna just. I forgot you're a steel type. What? No, you do not carry bulldoze. Stop. Did 46 damage? Are you kidding me? Fuck off. Send out muck? Okay, let's send out Tinkatuff. Obviously, we're immune to its stab. It can't poison us.
Except I don't know what Muck wants to do. What can Muck do? Mud Slap? Wait, does Mud Slap lower accuracy? Oh my god. I don't think... I don't think Brutal Swing misses though, does it? Does Brutal Swing miss? Oh, I guess it can. We haven't even got to the yellow. <laughs> oh my god. There's the miss. You're kidding me. Fucking stop it. Dude, why are we not- why do we not do any damage? We haven't done any fucking damage to this thing. I don't really have anything to hit it with either. I'm gonna send in the worm. And remember, we still have to fight the car. Oh, wait. This worm counters muck. Immune to its stab. Immune to ground type moves. What do you have now? Did I just. Did I. Do I wall muck right now? Hold on, let's get. Let's get healed up first. Be nice and safe. Guess now we'll just bulldoze. Go get him, Orthworm. Yeah, I can't believe I can't believe what I'm seeing here. 